too. <laughs> Friends and family, sick Kuroshki. So I've had a pretty interesting long day. Not really interesting. The only thing that is is like pretty much I went to a couple of the nice spas here and I checked them out. I'll leave the names down in the next video or maybe I'll leave them right here. Whoosh. But uh, now I'm ending my day off at the Pivorov. Which is Piva, Piva Rof. I don't know. Okay, excuse me, Piva Varov. <laughs> Someone who does beer. Someone who makes beer. So, Piva is beer in Russian. So, I'm at a place that makes beer. So. I've been always wanting to come at this place anyways and check it out so I'm ending my day off here at this restaurant and it's a Sunday so it's not too busy so we didn't have to make a reservation but uh, it's pretty nice uh, but yeah just, let's get back to look at all these Krushkas or Krushki da? Krushki I got translators right behind me making sure I'm not messing up my words <laughs> thank you um, but you ever got curious and decided like hey Google what are the top 10 best spas in near me that's pretty much what started this adventure today um, I found the top five places of spas to visit and uh, I went to Iridium spa and I've been to hello <laughs> I've been to Iridium Spa and I've been to uh, Rixis, yes, the Rixis Spa. So I'll let you know how my experience is when we get to the hotel room. Da? All right. some friends and family so I am out here at St. Regis Spa 
actually, let me rephrase that. Iridium Spa at the St. Regis Hotel. And uh, I figured I'd document the experience because it's a little pricey. It's a little pricey. Um, and I'm not sure if this place would be luxury for me to keep coming back over here. But uh, I'm sure some of y'all are going to be interested in wondering what the experience is going to be like. So stay tuned. I'll let you all know. I'll show you the videos of the, the surrounding area, the spa. You'll probably see some of it in the B-roll films. Uh, but it's time, it's time for this guy right here to relax and not worry about a damn thing. What's up, friends and fam? So, uh, I'll show you guys some of the footage of the spa area and also one of the very inf I shouldn't even say infamous. <laughs> Cut that out. <laughs> hey, what's up, friends and fam? So, I'm just gonna show you real quick the spa area here and uh, the Rix's President Hotel, Ostana, I think that's the name. I'll tell, I'll tell you the name better, but yeah, just check this out real quick. Uh, it's really nice. Next spot is like called the Relax Lounge. Let's see what I mean. Yeah, I got a chance. There's not a lot of people at all in this spa. So, awesome. Next, we got the pool area. I want to say this in front of the recession lady, but they're making me wear a shower cap. So I don't know how I feel about that. I don't usually wear a shower cap when I swim, but I mean, it's whatever. This is the hammam, the hammam room. It's like a, a wet sauna, and uh, I'll show y'all how it works. Um, it's pretty interesting. Hey 
friends and fam, so I was gonna tell you, this is like one of those style baths, almost like a thermal bath, but you're not getting inside any hot water. It's not like a hot tub. This is a Turkish style bath. It's called a hammam. Um, I've seen it one time in Istanbul, in Turkey, but here, I, I, don't, I didn't really get to explore Turkey that much, but here it's, I've seen a lot of moms everywhere here in Kazakhstan. So this is one of those experiences of being in one of those Turkish baths. So I wanted to share with y'all the footage I just shot for y'all. So I'm gonna chill. It's very peaceful in here. Dust for Danya.